What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Rome Good. Good promo. We back. Cameron. I was watching Cameron and May Sports Show. It is what it is. And Just Blaze's name came up. I would have thought Cameron and Just Blaze would have had a good relationship or was cool. But the way Cameron spoke of him, I don't think so. But let me bring a little context to this. Cameron and Mace were talking about Marshawn Lynch and his recent interview with Shannon Sharp on Club Shay Shay. It's a lot of clips that have been going viral about Marshawn Lynch speaking of Russell Wilson and the relationship they had and how they kind of didn't really have a relationship. Cameron brought up the legendary producer, Just Blaze. He was a Rockefeller producer. He produced a lot of songs. Um, he produced Old Boy for Cameron, uh, Welcome to New York City featuring Jay-Z. I really mean it off the Diplomat album. Just Blaze, he produced a lot of songs, a lot of hits. Just Blaze? Y'all know Just Blaze. But Cameron, he spoke of Just Blaze in comparison to Russell Wilson, saying that they kind of like the same type of individual. Check this out. But I can understand what Marshawn Lynch is talking about. Like, yo, I'm not dealing with this nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, like you know, no, no, it's, a, no it's a great example. And this is no shade on you, Neva. This is simply no, no shade. shade on who? Or just Blaze. All right. The producer. Yeah. Just Blaze is not a nigga nigga. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm a nigga nigga. Just Blaze is not a nigga nigga. He's a black man and he, he'll say nigga. But Just Blaze is a nigga. I give you, I just give you a great example of Marshawn Lynch and Russell Wilson and me and Just Blaze relationship. I think it's the same. You know, the old boy beat is sitting on the fucking, in, in the studio for two months. Nobody yeah. uses it. We, Joel's convinced me to steal the fucking song. We do the song, whatever. It's been sitting there for two months. I'm speeding through the story so we yeah. can move on. After we put it out, he comes up to me and is like, you know, um, Cam, we're going to absolutely get killed on the publishing. We didn't get clear the sample before we put it out and we're going to lose bad. And I'm like, all right, whatever, man. We should have been sitting there for two months. And by the way, Jay was mad at me behind that because he didn't understand why I gave you that beat and I didn't give him the beat. Was he talking like that? Yes. <laughs> so that's not a nigga nigga. What, what is that name? That's what is Russell that guy? Wilson. Oh, it's a Russell Wilson. And I'm Marshawn Lynch. This is what right. I'm telling you. This is what I'm trying to explain to you. So I said, yo, yo, just fuck it. It's a hit. Sometimes you got to give up the public. Jay-Z gave up over 100% of publishing for Hard Knock Life, which made yeah. him be who he is today. Sometimes, yeah. So I said, yo, man, fuck it, man. I, I, it been sitting there two months. Jay, nobody came. It been sitting there. I'm talking about when I say sitting there, Bleak coming in the studio, Beanie C, who come to the studio, Jake's coming to the studio. Yeah. Everybody's ignoring your fucking CD. I get that, Cam, but if we would have did things correctly and then went back and doubled back, we could have quadrupled what we really were going to make. Now we're not mm. going to get anything. I said, just, do you want to be a hit producer? Like, he said, not actually. My dream is Wall Street and to have restaurants or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> get the fuck out of my face, bro. Get the fuck out of my face, Just Blaze. Just, yeah. And then you know what happened? Just, yeah. You go back to the books. I shot Just Blaze out on all the songs. Oh boy, welcome to say all the songs. I shot Just so Blaze out. So he's Ivy League. Yes, definitely Ivy he's League. Ivy 100% League. Ivy League. And Jay Z wasn't, I told Just, you know, Just won't send me no beats. So I mean, these little shits I got to do with Just. I said, yo, Just, send me no beats. He don't send me no beats. Jay wasn't shouting just, just out. Yeah. I shouted just out all them songs. Name mm -hmm. the song Just Fire, all type of shit. Jay Z talking about Just Blaze and the Blaze ass. So the next day, Just here we go. <laughs> Ooh, Jay Z <laughs> said my name. Tap dancing. Hey, listen, <laughs> it is what it is. So to bring, I didn't mean to be long with it on it. That's the relationship, I believe, between Marshawn Lynch and Russell Wilson. You got nigga niggas and you got black men who don't like using the word nigga sometimes. Mm. And I wrap it there. And there's nothing wrong with being an Ivy League nigga. Nothing. There's nothing <laughs> wrong with it. At all. I mean, he didn't really say nothing bad about him, but he didn't really speak of him in a good light. Just Blaze is who he is. He he probably not a street guy. He might not be from the hood. You know what I'm saying? He talented, though. You can't take away from his talent. Let me know some of the songs that he produced that y'all think is fire. One that sticks out for me is from the Diplomats album, Diplomatic Immunity. I really mean it. Y'all just kids, see what I just did? Take a couple bars off, let just live. Yeah. What y'all think about this? What y'all think about Cam? What he said about Russell Wilson? What he said about Just Blaze, the comparison? Check out that episode of It Is What It Is, season two, episode 21. Check out the whole show. And hey, yo, shout out to my subscribers. The old ones, the new ones. I appreciate y'all. I'm gonna have a video coming real soon. It's your boy, Rome Good. I'm on y'all next time. Peace.